this video we will show our new design GSM gate opener RTU5024 okay we take out the controller first then and the inside the pack there also the USB programmer then you can connect the device to PC use the PC software to program it that would be more easier than the traditional SMS programmer this is the antenna inside. Okay. We mount the antenna. Also, have an instruction paper inside. Okay, now we start to test it. Firstly, the back, there is screw. We can unscrew it to mount the SIM card. Okay, this wide connector that is for USB PC grammar. Then this side use the piece USB wire to connect to PC. Okay, now we don't use it. This is a switch for the inside battery. No power on during shipping. Switched to off, and if we start to use, we switched to on. Okay, now start to night. Okay, we switched back and insert the SIM card. There is a button that is for reset. Can use it to reset the password. Okay, slide this side to lose the SIM card holder. Okay, take it out. Put it inside and this side to lock it, put it back, lock it, okay. And normally we need to mount it back, but now during test we don't mount it. Just put it aside. Okay, now we connect the antenna. Okay. Okay, and now we, we need to power on with DC 12 voltage. We already prepared the DC 12 voltage. Okay now, just after power on, the GSM signal will start to flash quickly, around two times per second. And after connected, it will flash slowly around one second, two times. Can okay now already connected. This new version have has has maximum one thousand authorized numbers. And the traditional is only 200. Okay, now we open the APP RTU5024. And add a new device. Access number is this, for example, gate. Gate one. Okay, access number. Access number is the SIM card inside this. Gate one. This number is the device number. Access control password is default one two three four. Okay, now already add add a new device gate one. Press it, and we can add a add the authorized numbers. Add order line number. For example, add it to zero one. This is also can be used to assess the power failure alarm. Always control. Okay. We confirm it. We send it. After send, we wait the SMS reply. Okay, start to fl start to send. Okay, we received, and now we can use 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 our number to control it. Dial 
答应。And the relay will be triggered. Okay. The click is the, re the relay is triggered. Okay. Switch it off. Another click. And now we need to switch the battery, switch on the battery, and the battery also. Now the battery also give the power to the board. If the DC twelve voltage is powered on, the battery will be charged, and if the DC twelve DC twelve voltage failure, the battery will sub supply the power to the board to send the alarm SMS. Okay. Now we try to test. We switch off the 12 voltage. Can wait. If send the SMS, it will start to flash. Okay, send the alarm SMS. Okay, battery power working alarm. This send the alarm. You will know the gate is powered failure. Okay, now we power it back with the DC twelve voltage. It will also send the SMS to report the status. We just okay send the SMS. Okay, back to normal power working. Okay, back to normal power working. Okay, now we already finished the test. If you want to know more features of this controller, you can check our website. Also, uh, you can contact us. Thank you.